That's Brian Gilliotti. Once again, I'm a little further down on I-95, heading southbound. I'm looking at a potential, another lithic site. Especially what I see in front of me. This is a stone wall. The jury's out. This is property marker or not. <laughs> so this land is not very cultivatable. Oh. I have to be quick. This is a preliminary shot. The thing I see that caught my attention on the highway. Is this. Wow. <laughs> This looks to me like another cliff edge stone. Yeah. Neatly resting on the bedrock. Yeah. Again, uh, too many congruences at the same time for me to believe that this was the result of glacial movement. I'm gonna head up a little bit. And uh, see if there's anything else, at least what I could see initially. I'm sure there's a lot out here, but I just don't have time right now. Question is, are there any roads? Or is this one big patch of land? Well, definitely uh, something odd going on here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I make out of this. It's definitely some uh, ice expansion weathering. This is one interesting stone wall. It just pops up out of the middle of nowhere. Very strange wall too. So it forms a Y. <laughs> Makes use of uh, natural boulders right on the edge of a cliff. Well, at this point, I'm going to uh, shut off the video, and I got to make my way back to the highway. Hopefully, my trail.io app will find some sort of, uh, will identify the local area and any potential roads so I can more safely, I can access this place more safely.